But first, we're going to say one big thank you a sur and surprise a wonderful NHS nurse called Nanny Sue, who, like thousands of others, has been going above and beyond during the current crisis. We'll see uh, the surprise, and it's a got a good surprise very shortly but first let's get to know her and uh, let's find out why she is such a special person I nominated my nanny for this because she's worked so hard over the years she's worked for the NHS for over 40 years and the scouts for 44 I believe my mum is an NHS worker my aunt is an NHS worker my brother's an NHS worker and that all stems down to my nan even when Covid came about she stood with her family and wanted to continue doing the job that she loves she's 69 almost 70 and she's still adamant she will work through this pandemic can't stop her never have never will <laughs> My nanny, for the past 40 years, has given up every Friday and her holidays to being a Beaver Scout leader. She took her children to the camps, grandchildren have also gone on the camps, and now my daughter, her great-granddaughter, now goes on all the camps. We know Nanny's finding this really difficult at the moment. She's used to being with everybody, um, so we just wanted to show her how thankful we are for her and how much we love her. Yes, no surprise that she really is a remarkable woman. So what happened next? Well, knowing how much time and energy Nanny Sue, or Chippy, as she's also known, puts into the beavers, we decided to set up a call. Now, little did she know, though, that I was about to make a surprise appearance. Hi, beavers. Are you all right? Yeah. Have you missed me? <laughs> Hello, beavers. I'm really sorry to interrupt your call, but I have got a special message for Chippy. Nanny Sue, can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Hello, it's Alex here from BBC One's One Show. Oh. Every week, we like to say one big thank you to somebody special. And this week, your granddaughter, Danielle, has nominated you. And I've got a very special message here from Bear Grylls, Chief Scout. Here he is. Hi, Susan. What an incredible lady you are. You're a hero to the NHS, a hero to many scouts. We're so proud of you. Oh, Beavers, I think we should give Nanny Sue a big round of applause. How are you feeling? A bit tearful. <laughs> Oh, now you've been setting challenges for the beavers yeah. and we've also set the beavers a challenge. So if you would just go to your front door. Oh! Hi, Nanny. I nominated you for this because I think you're truly amazing. You're an inspiration to everyone. Thank you for everything you do at Beaver. She'd be a lovely in the Beaver. She'd always go above and beyond for anybody. She's a real credit to the NHS. What we want to do right now is keep you safe inside, but you'll insist on helping others. Thank you for being our Beavers leader. Thank you, Shippy, for being a brilliant nurse and doing the Beavers for over 40 years. And over that time in Scouts, you've helped thousands of young people achieve their potential. Thank you from all of us. Enjoy this, Mum. I love you so much. You're one in a million. What do I say? Glory. Are you still recording this? I've got my slippers on. <laughs> oh my great, all oh my grandchildren, wow. <laughs> I haven't seen them for ages, no. When you've got grandchildren that are older, that still hurt because you can't see them, but they understand more than that. <laughs> Sorry, not the little ones too. I just want to go and hug them all. Oh, we love Nanny Sue or Chippy. Such a nice, such a nice woman and so modest. So modest. So humble about all of it. It's yeah. just very special. Now, if you've got someone...